it is Peach. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, but today is title. I'm going to give some tips on how to deal with a toxic toxic workplace or working with someone that's a bit quote unquote toxic. Um, just because if you're in a situation where you can't get up and leave the work, whatever the reason is, so I thought I would give some tips to help you to get through the work environment. So let's get this video started. So my first step is don't meet the witness with witness because I feel like that's not going to get anywhere. You're just going to get more upset, not well mentally and everything. So either if you truly need to respond, you can respond. Now with witness, try to be as calm as possible, as polite to as possible or just ignore it. My second tip is to spend the, uh, your time with the co uh, your co-workers that you do like or enjoy spending your time with because I feel like it just makes it easier to forget that one specific person that you don't get along with. No, my third tip is to, if it helps you, is to sit down and talk to that co-worker just to see if they might change or they try their best to try not to be as rude or everything and it might help you to get everything out of your chest so probably sit down and talk to your co-worker that's being rude my fourth tip is to if you're not going to sit down and talk to them uh, maybe find someone else to sit down and talk and just let everything out because I feel like if you hold everything in, you go and lash out on everybody and that's something that you don't want to do. My fifth tip is to choose your battles. Um, is it really worth it to argue with this person every single day and everything? Uh, so, so just choose your battles and is it really worth it or not? Number six is to try to make a, record, a physical record of that person, um, whether they come in late or if they're just being rude or whatever, try to make a record visible just in case something happens and you have proof saying, hey, this is what's been happening. And Number seven is maybe talk to, to your superiors, um, explain the situation or what's going on, how you're feeling about it and everything because I feel like uh, it is important for your superiors to know on what's going on because if you don't say anything and some if something exposes up because if something happens <clears throat> and you talk to your superiors you're like well this is really gone no 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 then your superiors are not going to believe you have a they're going to have a hard time believing you and that you're just lashing out because you're getting in trouble for something well if you already told them ahead of time if something comes up, they're like, okay, well, okay, yeah, this happened, but this has been going on with this specific person going on. So, yeah, this. My next tip is to try to adapt a healthy um, habit uh, mechanism and stuff like that. So, write down any journal or something on how you're feeling. Um, go out, go outside, do something, go to uh, the gym or something to let everything out and everything so yeah so that's all the tips I have at the moment um I hope this helps um if you enjoyed this video give this video a thumbs up because it'll help out my channel a lot um don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I do upload every Friday and don't forget to follow all of my social medias since uh I am certain and if you want to see more me explain more of things and everything, follow all of my social media and I see